Hello, I'm Teacher Cherry, and welcome to my class. Before we start, let's check our answers in our last activity using cherriesclassroom.com. Here is the activity. Just click Answer. Today's lesson is reading and writing numbers up to 100,000 in symbols and in words. Let's have a quick review about symbols and words from your past lesson in grade 3. Listen and show me the number in symbols and in words. First number is 15. Number 15. Next, number 31. 31. Let's see how much you can still remember. Number 115. 115. Next, 731. 731. Now you remember the difference between numbers and symbols and numbers in words. This time, we are going to read and write larger numbers. Digits in larger numbers are in groups of three places. These groups are called periods. Ones period, thousands period, millions period, and many more. Periods are separated by space or commas. Let's use a place value chart. To read this, you start from here up to the ones period. Let me share an easy way to read numbers. Listen carefully. Number plus period. Number, period. Read the number, then the singular form of the period. No need to say the period in one's period. One hundred million one hundred thousand. Those zeros in one's period has a value. We don't need to read those. One hundred million one hundred thousand. So how do we read this? Remember, number plus period. Except, in one's period, there's no need to read the period. 12,000, 817. I didn't mention one for one's period. 12,000, 
817. Let's try some more. Remember. Number 15. Period. Thousand. Without S. Comma. 911. How about this? Nineteen thousand six in symbols and in words. How about this? Listen seventy eight thousand three hundred twenty eight. Seventy eight thousand three hundred twenty eight. Seventy eight thousand three hundred twenty eight in symbols and in words. Notice something. These are hyphens. Always hyphenate numbers 21 up to 99 when writing them out in words. These are compound numbers. Two-digit numbers like 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90 are one-word numbers. These numbers don't need a hyphen when writing them in words. Same with 11 up to 19. Let's try. Read and write in words. Twenty five thousand one hundred sixty eight. Write this in symbols. So remember in reading numbers in symbols and in words. In writing numbers in symbols and in words, I think you are ready for a test. Write the numbers correctly in words and in symbols. Checking of attendance. Just comment present as I mention your name. Shout out to Jet Mercado and Ate Jo. Answers and more of this lesson at cherriesclassroom.com.